Gatherings to me is a time to take a break from all the busyness of school and schoolwork and co-curriculum activities to um, reflect and think. Um, to me, gatherings are sort of a time of reflection and a time to respect the Quaker philosophies. Gatherings sort of a time to just sit and you get to sit with your new group and even if you're not really thinking about actually the theme that's being talked about, you're still sort of having some time, quiet time, like maybe to yourself or things like that. So it's something still that they could take a break out of like time as well. see a lot of people and you can tell that they're not kind of off in some other world like um, it's really nice to see everyone sort of together as a year group and everyone kind of thinking about what's going on or not necessarily like Maddie said not not necessarily the theme of the gathering but thinking about something and kind of not being disruptive and it's just a really nice time to kind of come together and kind of reflect and think and take a bit of a time out. Gatherings sort of, I don't know, they mean a lot more to me than they did four years ago because I came from a different primary school and I remember having my interview and they were like, so did you know that our school is a Quaker school? And I was kind of like, uh, what? Because <laughs> I had no idea. And so in the first year it was sort of difficult to adjust because I hadn't been used to that sort of thing. purpose uh, of gatherings at the French School um, is to provide an opportunity for students uh, to come together um, and to do two or three things. Uh, one is to collectively um, gather and share, not so much a silence, that's on the outside, but uh, a stillness of mind. Um, and so the second purpose is to, once that stillness for an extended period of time um, has been achieved, to allow the mind to go to a more intuitive level of thinking. And that's where ideas of wisdom, the testaments, um, and ideas about how to live, and what is, what is the best way of living, um, those, those ideas come up. And, and so, being all together, that is a wonderful time for people to actually share uh, those ideas and as a community, whether it's a year 10 community or a year 11, 12 community, to actually build the wisdom, the stock of wisdom in, the, uh, in that group. Gatherings are a time to reflect and think. From being able to stand up and say what you think, because I know that for a lot of people that's a hard thing to say something in front of peers in case you're getting judged. And even if, um, even if it's not you that stands up and says something, or I don't know, you don't really talk to the person who stands up and says something to the whole year group. Even if you don't know it, you're sort of unconsciously thinking about what they've said. And when I come into meeting house, I feel everything. So we're coming up to exams and everything's going to be pretty hectic. So um, I guess I'm just thinking, uh, sitting here thinking that um, you know we may complain about exams and that it stresses out, and all that, but there are a hell of a lot of people in the world that don't even have the opportunity to, you know, to say yes, I want to take an exam. They don't have that choice. So. and I remember the first thing I thought about gathering was why are we doing this? I really don't like sitting in silence for an hour because I'm one of the most fidgety people ever. <laughs> and when I first started we were doing gathering and I'd sit there and I'd kind of look around and I'd fidget and I'd cough and I'd just be like, oh, I really don't want to be here. Um, but I'd, and, I, and I just didn't know what it meant. And 
if people kind of ask me, you know, how was your day or whatever, and I was like, oh, we had gathering, it was really crap, I didn't understand it, and I'd just say, oh, we just sat in silence for an hour. But as kind of the years have gone by and we get to here and I know that that's not what it is, that's not what it means, you don't just sit in silence for an hour. You know, you just, you, there are things that you think about, you reflect on, you're taking your time out. And it has quite literally taken about five years for me to work that out, really. But, um, yeah, so it's definitely been a journey.